Good Sunday morning to you. I'm Storm Track 8 meteorologist Marcus Bailey. Thanks for logging on to WishTV.com and the Wish TV weather app. Quick update on Hurricane Irma. The 5 a.m. update keeps Irma as a category 4 storm with sustained winds of 130 miles per hour, gusts as high as 160, and now making that track to the north and west about 40 miles south southeast of Key West and it is taking aim on Key West that will happen by early to mid morning uh, where they'll feel like the brunt of that. Then the track will actually ride up the Gulf Coast. Fort Myers, Naples will feel the brunt of Irma as we get deeper on into your Sunday. And then as it rides along the coast, it should start to weaken a little bit, but still as a category three around midnight tonight around the Tampa area before then it heads toward the panhandle still is a category one storm even as it makes its way into southern portions of Georgia and then eventually we'll be working into the Tennessee Valley as we head into the middle portion of the week that could play a role in our forecast as we get into Tuesday and Wednesday more on that in a second but beautiful weather locally for us to close out the weekend 54 at 9 o'clock 67 at noon and 73 at 4 o'clock so again below average with that northwest flow low to mid 70s for everybody today of course Colts uh, first game of the regular season away in Los Angeles against the Rams. Beautiful weather, no surprise, out in L.A. 81 around kickoff, 86 by the end of the game. Back home, should be pretty quiet this evening, 65 at 9 o'clock, 62 at 11. And another cool start tomorrow morning, especially at the bus stop, upper 40s and outlying areas to around 50 degrees as we roll into uh, your Monday morning. May see a few more clouds as we roll into your Monday, but otherwise we're dry. 69 at noon and then 76 will be your afternoon high to kick off the work and school week. Now, we do bring shower chances into the forecast starting Tuesday. This will be later in the day and it would be the remnants of uh, Irma, probably for the southern half of the state, very scattered, relatively light. Better chance for more widespread rain coming in on Wednesday for everyone. But again, I don't think it's going to be real heavy stuff at this point. Still cloudy on Thursday, but I do think we dry out. And then Friday looks good. Weekend looks better with temperatures returning to the low 80s Saturday and Sunday.